My last big theorem for spherical geometry that I'm going to look at, if two triangles have the three angles of one congruent to the three angles of the other, then they are congruent. This is essentially the AAA congruence criteria that does not exist for Euclidean geometry. In order to do this, I'm going to start with two triangles. We'll call them ABC and XYZ. See here, I have triangle ABC. And then down here, I have XYZ. And we know their angles are congruent. So angle A is congruent to angle X, B is congruent to Y, and C is congruent to Z. If any one of my sides are congruent to a, one of the sides down here, so for instance, if AB is congruent to XY, then I'll be done since I'll have angle side angle. So I need to assume that none of the sides are congruent. Since none of the sides are congruent, Either one triangle has all three sides greater than the other, or it has two sides greater than the other. If it had one side bigger than the second triangle, then the second triangle would have two sides bigger. We're going to assume ABC is the one with at least two sides that are bigger than triangle XYZ. In particular, I'm going to suppose AB is greater than XY and BC is greater than YZ. I then want to construct a segment BD so we'll say D is about here, on side AB such that BD is congruent to XY. So essentially I'm going to take this longer side and just kind of cut it off to be congruent to this triangle down here. I'm also going to construct a point E on segment BC such that BE is congruent to YZ. So essentially I'm just going to kind of cut off this little triangle here so that these here are congruent. That tells me triangle BDE is congruent to triangle YXC by side angle side or by angle side angle. I'm also going to draw this segment AE essentially to break up this little trapezoid thing that I have going on here into smaller triangles. And I'm then going to denote the excess of each of these smaller triangles by excess 1s, 2, and 3. Excess 1 plus excess 2 is also a triangle, triangle ABE, so this is equivalent to the excess of triangle ABE plus the excess of 3. Well, once again, when I have additivity, this would be the excess of my triangle ABC. However, since I took excess 1 and added some stuff to it, I know this is greater than the excess 1. I also know that the excess of triangle ABC is equal to the excess of triangle XYZ since these two had the same angles. So their angle sum will be the same and the difference from 180 will be the same. However, the triangle of XYZ, since it's congruent to BDE, would have excess 1. This would also be excess 1 since these two triangles are congruent. And now I have a contradiction. I have the excess of triangle ABC being greater than E1 and equal to E1. So I'm done. These triangles had to be congruent to start with. And this essentially tells me that in spherical geometry, similar triangles do not exist. If all three angles are the same, my triangles are congruent.